German culture. Just how important is it? To most of us here in Florida, it may not seem like much, but the fact is, it's everywhere. Even here in Orlando at Rollins College. But still, you gotta wonder, just how much influence does it really have? Well, let's find out. Our first destination is the Holocaust Memorial Resource and Educational Center located in Central Florida. My name is Eva London Witt. I was born in Hamburg, Germany, and I've been associated with the Holocaust Memorial Resource and Education Center of Florida since 1980 at its beginning to teach the students the lessons of the Holocaust, to teach them tolerance and understanding, and also the teachers to teach the Holocaust. It's also a memorial to the six million Jews uh, who perished in the Holocaust, and we have oral histories that tell their story, and this is available for generations to come. And to me personally, it's very important because I'm a Holocaust survivor as well, and so many of my family were murdered in the Holocaust. In addition to the Holocaust Museum, there are several other locations with important German cultural aspects. Our next stop is Walt Disney World. So is there a lot of German cultural influence in Central Florida? We've asked our two native Germans just that. Oh yes. Quite a lot. Yeah. But just in Florida, in the whole US. All, all the US. And every day we have guests coming by and they tell us Oh, I'm from Germany actually, or my grandparents are from Germany, or I have German heritage, and they feel very familiar with our culture, and they want to share it with us. As seen at the Epcot Center, Disney is able to bring German culture to millions of Americans right here in Orlando. But what about education? Can students go abroad and experience the culture for themselves? We went to UCF to find our um, answer. We have programs in... Münster, Germany. We have an intensive summer program and uh, some of the students, we worked with uh, Dr. Nancy Decker uh, at Rollins College uh, on this program. As a matter of fact, it was Dr. Decker who found the school in uh, Münster for us and it has a certain number of advantages that um, our previous schools did not have. Uh, we're able to offer um, intensive uh, language training at more different levels than we were able to offer before. As for the younger generation, Rollins College offers the Saturday German school program known as the Deutsche Schule, which gives children the unique opportunity of being able to learn a second language at a very early age. brought me over from Germany to be a tutor for German here as well as a teacher at Deutsche Schule. So I'm teaching at Deutsche Schule every Sunday and I really think it's a great opportunity to preserve the German heritage here in Orlando. Okay, children actually just joined in the last couple of weeks. It really is astounding to see how they respond um, to uh, learning German. To further straighten the German communities, a German language church service is being offered as well in the Central Florida area, which is currently being hosted by the St. John Lutheran Church right here in Winter Park. According to Father Absol, as witnessed here, we want to be a friendly group welcoming everybody who is looking for a place to celebrate the Christian faith. And we are always open to those who, for one reason or another, are interested in learning the German language. Well. As we've seen, German culture is, in fact, everywhere here in Florida. And just like any other culture, it's unique. Well, I'm Greg Kometic, representing all the German classes out here around the college. And I hope you enjoy a little documentary. Better rest the camera for me, guys.